Hello, everyone. If you haven't heard about Anchor, it's the new free uh, podcast um, app. Uh, anyone can download it. It's on Android and iOS. There's um, a lot of creation tools that you get to use for free. It gives you your RSS code, and you can use it on your phone or computer. Anchor will distribute your podcast for you. Spotify, Apple Podcasts, many more. Uh, you make money from your podcast with no minimum leadership. Everything you need in one place on one app. Don't forget to download yours today, now. Hello, podcast world. Welcome to my channel. It is 4-27-2021 at 9.13 p.m. And I'm here to talk about Mortal Kombat. Oh, yeah. Today is just the day to talk about Mortal Kombat. It is definitely a day like no other. And here we are, Mortal Kombat. The new Mortal Kombat. The, um... The storyline starts off with Scorpion's family, uh, the Hizu Ryu um, clan, or whatever. And how Sub Zero's clan, the Alutinari clan. Again, I'm not even gonna try to say the uh, the name of their clans, cause screw it. I don't know how to say it, right? <laughs> just just follow along. It's going to be the Sub-Zero and the Scorpions, you know. So, um, Scorpion is there with his family, and this is this is also my take on it. It's almost like some triads versus uh, the Yakuza's, you know, type stuff. Again, ancient history, because Japan and Chinese, they have been going at each other for years, um, something, I don't know. It's, it's ancient, you know. Again, it's just another uh, racial discrimination situation. Uh, we all, I mean, even in Africa, you got the, this tribe versus that tribe. So, it doesn't really matter, you know. The north versus the south, the left versus the right, east versus the west, you know. It's all the same. And it's like that in different, like, cities or whatever. You could be the north side versus the south side in your own city. Or, you know, here in my city, we got the whole Texas versus Arkansas thing going, you know. Rival is a rival is a rival. It goes back as far back as, I want to say, Cain and Abel, you know. Like, think about it. And with that being said, let's talk more about this Mortal Kombat. In this Mortal Kombat, Sub Zero kills. He kills the wife and son of Scorpion. And ultimately, he kills Scorpion. But he managed to hide. <coughs> They managed to hide the last of his bloodline, which was Scorpion's daughter. Now, this is how the movie begins. They even have clips on it, the first seven minutes of uh, Mortal Kombat. And Radiant comes down after it's all said and done, and takes the little one, and boom. That's the beginning of the movie. Then, you, uh in the future and you're seeing Scorpion's ancestor who bears the mark of the tournament of mortal combat one of the champions of earth is pretty much how they put it and he's like an MMA fighter but apparently he used to be a good MMA fighter and now he's just the guy that they uh, call on when you want somebody to last because he can, he can take it, you know. So he's in there basically getting beat up, pummeled, and not really throwing any punches or fighting back or anything. So it's kind of like, why is he doing it? Why does he want to fight? What is he fighting for at this point in time? This is what you really want to know. So um, my friend said that, he didn't really like it because in comparative to the original Mortal Kombat, the storyline 
isn't the same. The storyline is not what you think it is. Now, I am sure that you want a story that is like beginning, middle, and end, you know, told, no twist, all that. Or maybe a little twist or whatever. But that's not how this story goes. That's not how this story is told. So whatever it is you think that you're getting at this point in the game, then cool. It's not what you thought it was. Right? Right. Bear with me. Oh, man. Talking makes you really thirsty, by the way. So I always have something to drink. Um, water, if possible. That's the trick. I'm sitting here drinking that new Sun Kiss Berry Lemonade. It's blue. It just stood out on the shelf and it, it jumped into my buggy. So, like, oh, yeah. Right into my shopping cart. Had to get four of them. Two liters. But anyway, um, it's just like they, they were all over the place. Uh, first, it starts off, um, you know. That happened. Then you see him with his daughter and wife. Then you got Jax in the mix. And Jax is like... um, If you're not familiar with the actor who Jax is, he's played in um, BET's The Game. He's played... He plays Jimmy Olsen or Guardian or whatever on Supergirl, you know. These are two of the shows that I know that I'm familiar with him being on. He's a good actor, you know. I, I like the guy. And he plays Jax in this movie. And so he um, basically is, he's been branded with the Guardian symbol of Mortal Kombat. Along with Kano, who... You know, he's the the guy that his finishing move was uh, rip your heart out. And uh, let's see, Kun Lao was in there, Liu Kane is in there, Raiden is in there, Sonya Blade, Goro, uh, Sang Soon. Yeah. So. You got all the primary characters that you need in this movie. It's just how they they didn't they didn't really build up anything to let you know who they were. They just brought them together and was like, "Hey, y'all need to uh, you know, y'all need to know that this is coming or whatever. Y'all the protectors of this earth realm or whatever. The people from Outworld are coming, you know, why people are coming and they they trying to uh, get y'all, you know. Because of that brain that you have on you, you you got gifts, you know what I'm saying? You got special powers. So be ready to unleash the demons or uh, or unleash them, or whatever. So, like I say, people keep asking me what I thought of the movie, and it was great with the action, just not so much when it came to um, going across the span of the story that is being told with what is Mortal Kombat and who are these people and how do we get to this point. It just kind of happened. Things just kind of happened. And um, most people who are into, let's say, Mortal Kombat, these real Mortal Kombat fans and stuff, they're asking, they're trying to figure out Hey, um, where did who is Luke Kane and who is Sonya Blade and who is Jax and who is this guy and who is that guy? Like, it's nothing is really explained in this movie. Shit just happens, you know. It's just like a hailstorm of action. Shit just falls out of the sky. You don't understand why. Uh, Scorpion and Sub Zero are fighting at the beginning. You don't understand why any of that is happening. So, you know, these are what's, you know, what you gotta worry about. Had everything you needed to know about 
Mortal Kombat is you got to be careful because you never know when they're going to finish you, you know. And that's pretty much what it was, and that's pretty much what it is. Just a real quick review. Tune in to me next time, and we'll see what it is and what we're going to do. Thank y'all. Peace. Hello, YouTube world. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I drop hot content like this. And stay tuned for the next video.